The Capital City Kiwanis Club invites you to participate in its inaugural Firecracker 5K run tomorrow morning. And joining us this morning to talk about it is Amber Tynan, the incoming vice president of the Capital City Kiwanis Club. Thank you for joining us this morning. Thanks for having us. So tell us about this event. Yeah, it's in its inaugural year. We um, actually took the idea from Greensboro, Florida to have the five, five, Firecracker 5K. It's going to take place tomorrow morning at 730. Registration starts at 630 and all proceeds go back to programs that we have here in Tallahassee to support our youth and their families. Talk with us about where the run starts and what the path is going to be. Um, that's a great question. It's going to take place at Phipps Park right off of Miller's Landing Road. It's a 3.1 mile race track and we'll also have a one mile fun run. So they'll actually start together and they'll loop around twice if they're doing the 5K and loop around once if they're doing the one mile. Okay. And um, as far as registration goes, do people need to register ahead of time or can they just show up? Um, we're asking that people do pre-register. It is $20, um, you, so you'll have a little bit of a price break, but you can register on site. That is $23 a day of, and we'll be doing that up until the race starts at 7.30. And t-shirts will be given out there as well. Correct. Are you guys in inviting people to, because of course it's 4th of July, mm -hmm. so are you guys inviting people to, to dress up or in costumes or anything fun? We, we didn't send that out, but I'm sure we'll have a couple of people with some creative ideas, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, of course, in the red, white, and blue for sure. Yes. And talk with us about the, where the money will be going toward. Yeah, absolutely. Capital City Kiwanis Club is an international organization. We were actually chartered here in Tallahassee in 1959 and as an overall organization we go to fight maternal and neonatal tetanus so we provide the immunizations for um, the babies and the mothers that you know um, have that disease but locally the money will go directly to um, programs like elder care services meals on wheels we work with echo ability first to build ramps for disabled uh, folks in their homes and it also helps with our sponsored youth programs in the school system like K kids Kiwanis uh, Key Club and uh, Circle K and colleges. Okay, and if people want to register, um, they just go on online, or do they give you guys a call? Um, they can go to active.com, and they'll see us listed directly on the on the left hand side. Is there a registration deadline for this? Nope, they can register okay. up until 7:30 tomorrow morning. Okay, and then of course the run taking place early in the morning, so you have plenty of time to go home mm -hmm. and get ready for any kind of afternoon barbecues or festivities happening out at Tom Brown Park. You guys will also be out at Tom Brown Park tomorrow night as well. We will. We'll actually be pouring all the beer tomorrow night, and the proceeds will help with our initiatives as well. Okay, so get the run out early. That way you can head on down to Tom Brown Park. Again, uh, the run is going on tomorrow morning. Uh, On-site registration starts at 6.30 a.m., is it that does. correct? Race starts at 7.30 a.m. at the Eleanor Clapp Phipps Park on Miller Landing Road. 20 bucks with a t-shirt, $15 without a t-shirt. That's pre-registration and $23 the day of the race. Um, and you can go to capitalcitykiwanisclub.com or also, you said active? Active.com directly to register for the race. To register or you can call 850-322-1805. We'll also be putting all of this information up on our website, WTX. Dot TV. Amber, thank you for joining us this morning. Thank you, Abby.